the 38-year-old rapper and actor, who stars as Roman Pierce in the action movie franchise, recently blamed his co-star for delaying the release of the ninth installment until 2020 after a spin-off movie starring Dwayne and Jason Statham was announced for 2019. And now, Therese has claimed he will pull out of the movie altogether if bosses decide to bring back Dwayne's character Hobbs, as the star now refuses to work with Dwayne, whom he has been feuding with since 2016, when the former wrestler slammed some unnamed Fast and Furious stars on social media. Aching to Instagram to share a snap of himself alongside Dwayne and fellow star Vin Diesel, Therese wrote, Hello world, hello loyal fans and loved ones from our fast universe, I'm sorry to announce that, if Dwayne is an FAST9 there will no more Roman Paris, you mess with family and my daughter's survival I mess with yours, close your eyes dude you're a clown, number candy asked made all my real one, men on integrity, my real ones out here stand up. Folks that GP to the gym and get big naturally number N-O-J-U-I-C-E number nude spin off hot spin off these nut selfish champ, pause notice who's got his arms around my shoulder and who's standing alone. It comes after the rapper previously accused 45-year-old Wayne of abandoning the Fast and Furious's family to fly solo. In October, he wrote in a comment on one of Dwayne's Instagram pictures, If you move forward with that number Hobbs movie you will have purposely ignored the heart-to-heart -heart moment we had in my sprinter. I don't want to hear from you until you remember what we talked about. I'm on your timeline cause you're not responding T. Speculation of a feud between the male co-stars first surfaced last year, when Dwayne slammed unnamed actors for the way they allegedly acted on set. In his rant, the star praised his female co-stars, Charlize Theron, Jordana Brewster and Michelle Rodriguez, but admitted it was a different story working with the guys. He wrote, My female co-stars are always amazing, and I love them. My male co-stars, however are a different story. Some conduct themselves as stand-up men and true professionals, while others don't. The ones that don't, are too chicken-st to do anything about it anyway. Candy asses.